Hey, Nutty Buddies. Welcome or welcome back. It's Sandy and welcome to my Nutty Nook. Thank you so much for joining me. Today is a very special day. I have my first Timu collab sponsored. Um, I'm not sure what it's called, but I got through the Timu Influencer Program and figuring it out, I got $30 worth of things for free in exchange for this video. So Timo, Timo is a great place to shop. Um, what I picked is it shouldn't be a surprise to anybody who watches me regularly. I picked the theme of organization. So it's not a lot, but I did get some really nice good things here. Um, $30 worth of items for free in exchange for this video. And let's see, all of my codes, um, the Timu Influencer Code, Affiliate Code, um, Discount Code, my Fishland and Farmland Code, the, the links to every product will be linked and um, they make it easy for you to link your products when you're in a sponsorship. So that's nice. Each individual item will be linked in the description. And I really appreciate and thank you guys so much for taking the time out to watch this video. I, I hope that I'll um, have more sponsorships to come and we'll see how it goes. Okay, so I guess I kind of got some bigger items. So I'm going to start with the small one. I have my ring light over here on one of them. Oh, and at the end of this video, I'm going to show a little clip of the boys, Monster and Sawyer. They were on this couch before I sat down on it to film. And Monster's over here on the table where you can't see him snooping around. And I'll say, I'll explain how I made, how I did my nails, which at, at, at right now need to be redone. But in, instead of doing a video or trying to do that, um, I'll just explain, I'll just say what the little secret is. All right, so this is the first item. And it's a little travel jewelry box. And it comes in different colors and just zips open like this. And then there you've got a place for your necklaces or bracelets. You can put stuff here in this pocket. And then these little four little slots and then your rings. Nice little compact travel case. And hi, Monster Monster, do you want to come say hi? Do you want to tell everybody to have a happy Easter? Have a happy Easter, everybody. I, I, I'm going to go be seeing my mom tomorrow, um, which is Thursday, the Thursday before um, Easter, and staying over and probably seeing my nephews. And so it'll kind of be like an early Easter celebration for us. But, um, this container... Got the little compartments here. It's plastic. Oops, it's making a lot of, okay. Oh, it comes out like that. I mean, ah, oops. <laughs> oh goodness. I mean, <laughs> it's my nutty nook, something's gonna not go right. It's okay. It's just like this. Anyway, you can put this in the bathroom. Yeah, I mean, you can use this, use it for crafts, whatever you want to use it for. There's no set, definite way. This I um, have has a repurchase, and it's just so good. It's so nice and thick. Um, it's for your shoes. I mean, I guess you could put whatever you wanted in there, but it'll it, it's meant to wash your shoes in, and it's a thicker material here. It's, look at how it's a big, nice, good size. 
Like, it's big enough to fit over my big head. Do I kind of look like um, the yellow jackets a little bit? Not, maybe even the tiniest little bit? Maybe if I had a, a weapon. Okay. So this is nice. This is a really nice quality um, to use. And, and you don't have to just wash your shoes. You could put whatever, you know, undergarments, whatever, whatever uh, kind of, okay, the zipper's being a little tricky. Here we go, here we go. It just got stuck on the, okay, there we go. There we go. So. This I got, um, and that's why I kind of decided to do this video today, because I want to give this to my mom. My mom loves elephants. My aunt also loves elephants. And it's like a waterproof feeling in there. Really nice, soft feeling. I feel like, I mean, you could use this as a cosmetic bag, but she'll, she'll probably use this as like a carry-all to throw in her purse. Okay, now we're into the bigger things. So there's two things left and they're both pretty big. Okay, thing number one has my light on it and it's rotating shelves. Okay, and, and my husband was kind enough to put it together for me, but she said it wasn't hard. Okay, so this is it, and <laughs> woo, wee, <laughs> wee, wee, wee. Okay, so only only this tier uh, spins. This tier doesn't. This, there's no spinny. There's no spinny round round on the top shelf. But anyway, it's still nice. I mean, it looks nice. And I mean, again, bathroom, kitchen, craft table, you know, wherever you want. I mean, same thing with this. Shoot, now see, that's my bad. That That's, that's a me, that's, that's a me. It's a me, Mario. Okay, okay, okay. I just had to get it in there right. That's all. Okay, now the big, huge final item. And I can't say, I'm not supposed to say the name brand of this, what this is, but I do have one and you can still buy them. Okay. Boodle. You can still buy them. I bought one recently and it's pretty cool. It's um, silver and purple, but this is also cool. And I got it for Timu. Zero dollars in exchange for doing this video. Yay! But look, it it is cutesy. And if you know me, you know I don't mind. I'm a I'm a little kid in a grown-up's body. But here's the back. Here's the whole thing. Here's the front. You can see those little hearts. Shout out Adrian Miller. I'm sorry about the hearts. And shout out April Rain. Menopause and Madness. I hope things start looking up for you. Well, hearts. Little flowers sort of shapes. There's a little dip there. Look at here. Wow, 
secret storage. Okay, so then open it up and you just twist the little flower around and it opens up. Ooh, so, okay, let me get these. <laughs> they give you all kinds of stickers to decorate with. If you wanna decorate it, if you don't wanna decorate it, whichever. But you've got, here's the top compartment. You've got little sections here, sections here, sections here. And most likely, I will be decorating this with the stickers. And I'll show you at the end what I did. How I decorated it, what it looks like. But, um, awesome, yay! I most likely will be using this for my crafts, in my craft area, ta table I have. Let me show you the stickers real quick. Yeah, all these stickers, and they're in this little case kind of like this. It's like, you know, I opened it. So, here's a, here's a sheet of stickers. It's like, you, you can probably take some guesses. Take some guesses about the stickers I'm gonna use. <laughs> I can already clearly see a pattern. I hope everybody's doing good. And once again, I, I do appreciate you all. And uh, I hope everybody has a nice weekend and happy Easter. And just thank you so much for watching me. It really helps me out. So cute. Ooh, that's a really, really cute. Well, I'm giving away. Oh, well. I have no idea what this is. Is it a cuss word? I hope not. Ooh, -hoo -hoo. what's happening here? Is, you know, I know this isn't right, but when I see that, the first thing that pops into my head is an egg melt, uh, an egg cooking on the asphalt, and that's not it. I think it might actually be like a mushroom going for a swim. You guys, weigh in on the comments. What is this here? What is it? Is it a snowman melting? That would be sad. Looks like we got some Christmas shenanigans happening here, around here. Party time. Okay, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna share the secret of my nails. So it's, so I, for those of you that don't know, I did have a subscriber request this. So I'm putting it in here because I can see that this is a fairly short video, especially for me. Um, so what I've got on, I've got natural nails happening and I did used to bite my nails down past where you should be biting them if you're biting them at all. And I stopped, I stopped biting my nails by using Timu stickers and nail polish to remind me not to do it because I was putting my fingers in my mouth without even thinking. And I grew my nails out and now they are grown out and these are my natural nails. I've never used press-ons and I guess I'm not going to because I've asked a couple, I've asked one of my friends, Mary, and she said that it would mess my nails up so just to not do it. So, I mean, I've heard that around, so um, I'll just take her word for it and I'll just continue with the nail polish and the stickers which I'm having plenty of fun with. I love Timu's nail stickers. Um, they they helped motivate me to stop biting my nails after 40 plus years of biting them. Anyway, so, but this situation is nail polish. So it's my natural nails, and then I put uh, Miracle, Miracle Nail on it. 
on top after I shape them. I shaped them with this tool that I got from Timu. I will try to remember to add that in the description, the, the manicure tool set that I got. And um, then did the Miracle Nail, then uh, gel polish, which I, I did get some gel polish at Timu. It might not necessarily have to be gel nail polish. It might you can might be able to do it with regular nail polish, but me personally, I've only tried it with the gel. And then you have to have your little UV light, which you can also get at Timu, which I'll also try to remember to put in the description box for you. Um, and it's real, it's real inexpensive. And um, to put your nails, if you're using gels, then you need to have the UV lamp. So, and to put it in under there. Um, but like I said, you might maybe don't have to do all that. You might just be able to use regular nail polish and it does the same thing. I don't know. I've only done it with the, anyway. I decided that I didn't like the way that my raw nail on the inside looked. I just didn't like it. You know, like I'm, I have my nails all painted or stickered and I just didn't like, I didn't like how that looks. Like it's come off now, so I can show you. So it's come off a little bit, okay? So I, so I just didn't like that look. It looked unfinished to me. So I took my little nail polish and I painted on the inside here. And I did a sloppy job. Um, so a little extra went over the top and then I just kind of painted it down and but even without, even if I didn't do that, just painting the backs here, and there was stuff, there was on my fingers, and I, I just, you know, eventually just came off. Like the next time I washed my hands, it came off, you know. So yeah, it, I was messy with it. I was messy with it, and I just painted the back, washed my hands, it came off after it dried, after I dried it under the UV lamp, and I just painted it, and it just gives that illusion, like okay, so this one's come off. But this one is, I mean, some of it's coming off, but you can see here where I painted there. And so it get, it it's, makes it look darker there, but you can't do it if you don't have natural nails. But anyway, that's the trick, that's the secret, and it could be a whole lot better and a whole lot prettier if I actually took time with it. And also, Timu has these little things that are supposed to help you with that. And, you know, like, not going over the lines, if you will, not coloring over the lines. I've always been a line color over or whatever you call it. Now my hair is looking crazy. You guys see my, you see my bunny hat on my bunny, bunny cat. That represents me and my husband too. I'm the bunny. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this. And I'm going to put a, a clip at the very end um, showing, showing Monster and Sawyer getting kicked out of their little spot for me to do this video for you guys. Anyway, I love you all. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, Nutty Buddies!